before you got one in the net. Uh, yeah, no, I think we, we had a lot of chances, and their goalie played stellar both nights. I mean, I don't know how many shots we ended up putting up on him, but probably around 80, and, you know, he didn't give up, he didn't give, give us really any room for, for error, and, I mean, we had a lot of chances, and we just couldn't bury there for a while, and, you know, we had some, we scored some dirty goals, and I guess that's what it takes, you know, they're, they're a hard team to play against, they, they were making it really hard for us to get to the middle of the ice, and play the way we want to play, so... You know, we just kind of had to grind it out and improvise a little bit, and I think it, obviously it worked out. You know, we got the win and shootout, but it would have been nice to get the full three points there. You know, after the first period, what did you guys talk about correcting? Um, you know, just having to play hard. You know, winning those one-on-one -on -one battles. They were uh, they were really pushing. I think they got challenged last night by their coach. You know, we come out and blank them and put up three goals, and they came out and they were hitting, and it, it was they were hard to play against, and they were really clogging up the middle of the ice and. We were really stressing that we had to do that. They were uh, kind of locking on our wings, um, coming out of the zone. So we kind of started um, going high off the glass and having our weak side winger come across and pick up that puck. And I think that really helped out a lot for us. It went back and forth in this game. How were you guys able to weather the storm? Um, I think just uh, our conditioning. You know, we're, uh, we're, we're a good skating team, and I think we're very well conditioned. You know, I think our, a lot of times our best period is our third period. And I think that really helps us out. Um, I think towards the end of the game they were getting tired and we were kind of we were kind of taking them to, taking it to them there for a while. Just got that lucky bounce at the end there to tie it up and you know I, I think we just got to keep keep grinding and keep keep playing fast. That's what we're good at. In a shootout, what do you think you want? It's your turn when you go up and get ready to. Um, you know the ice is uh, not great towards the mm -hmm. end of the game. It was just 20 minutes and then another 10 minutes of of game time. So you know I was thinking shot. Uh, coach was thinking shot. So I was thinking shot. <laughs> But uh, I don't know. I last last time we played them, I had I went in the shootout and I had that same spot open, but I missed it. So I just kind of went down and gave him a little better fake and shot it a little left and posted. And I guess that, that's how it works out. <laughs> Robbie had some big saves in the shootout there. What you see from him? Um, you know, I know. I mean, if we go to a shootout and Robbie's playing, I, we're gonna win. If we can put one in the net, we're he, we're gonna win because we do shootout every Thursday and. It's hard to score against Robbie and, and Packy and Devin. All three of them are very, very good in the shootout. Packy's low and wide, and Devin and Robbie are very athletic and can move around very well. So I wasn't worried at all, at all about Robbie even. I mean, his first shootout, he was very calm, calm and composed. Did a great job. Awesome. Thanks. Right, thanks.